After decades of isolation, Myanmar is slowly opening up to the outside world. Still, this country is one of the poorest in East Asia, and access to safe drinking water is limited. For this reason, a local company is promoting clay water filters, a low-tech and low-cost technology that can be produced all over the developing world. Today, the team of Lilipad is distributing their filters, and Kowimbo says he's very happy because for the first time his village has clean drinking water. These filters passed many laboratory tests and are able to eliminate particles, bacteria, parasites, amoebae and even the Vibrio cholerae from water. But how do they work? We came at the Lilipad factory to discover it. Lilipad started in 2006. We are developing low-cost technologies in the areas of water sanitation and agriculture. We spent years living among the people, seeing what the needs are and how we can best meet those needs, but also build a business that can benefit the local people. So when we first came, we noticed that the people were drinking the water directly from the springs. We also saw the problem with the diarrhea, so we started testing the water in the area, and we noticed there's a lot of runoff from the animals from the farms going into the springs. And even if it is a clean source, they collect it and then store it at their home, it can get infected with disease. Clay filters provide a cost-effective solution to these problems. This because their components are simple, and almost universally available. We use a ratio of the clay and the rice husk mixed together, and then we add water. So after this clay form comes out, we put it into a hydraulic press. Later, they dry the pot, fine shape it, and fire it in a kiln. Here, the rice husks burn away and make the pot porous, transforming it into a filter. Finally, they coat the filter with an antibacterial agent called silver nitrate. We've been making the water filters for almost 10 years, and on average, we are distributing 1,500 to 2,000 filters a year. So if one filter reaches a family of maybe five, so that's a good percentage of people who now have access to clean water. Lilipad's filters last around two years and cost $10. But thanks to private donations, the price can be as low as $3. This technology has also been used during natural disasters, like in 2008, when the cyclone Nargris hit Myanmar. Fresh water was contaminated with salt, but people used Lilipat's jars to filter rainwater. It's been very useful for us to have the factory right here in Myanmar, where it's not a product they have to buy from outside. So our locals can now make the filters themselves. They don't need the outside help from other countries. They know how to make the technology themselves. <laughs>